Hey guys, it's Austin again. Welcome back. And I'm on my mom's computer, and um, yeah, you see that the background of that lamp right there. Just ignore that if you want to. Um, as you guys saw in my community post, I um, let me get the mouse. I forgot to turn it on. And um, I just saw the community. I made my first community post. I reached 516 subscribers. Which means when you get 500 subscribers, you get the community tab. But I was watching my video on those corrupt Street View images, and I decided I decided I would do what Teller did in September 2019, touring just random locations of Google Maps for fun. And I decided to do this as well. And warning, if I see new Street View in this video, I'm going to be shocked, and you're going to see it on camera. So here we go. What the? All right. What is this? I did not see this the last time I was on there. I'm just going to close out of that. Um, so where I am, I'm out of horror. This is Main Street. You know what? I'm going to... If I refresh the page, it might have new street view because... Um, I'll just click on Google Maps. Okay, so I'll see if, uh, 18151 has, uh, your street view. Nope. But they did redo, um, they added on the, that little mini mart right there. They added on and made it, it was like May 2020, like May 26th was the first time I, uh, went in there and, um, there's a, lots of different changes that happened to Mount Horb here. Um, oh, spoil it. Excuse my mom. She's um playing Google Music on Pandora on Google, and my sister is over, and they're making dinner upstairs. Um, if we go to October 2013, look at that. There used to be a house right there. And we'll go back to August 2011. There used to be. Oh, yeah, October 2013. There used to be a tree right there. Or there, there, used to, there used to be no tree there, but if we go to August 2011, see, they were in the process of cutting that tree, got dead somehow. That tree didn't grow, that tree got killed. Well, look at that tree in July 2009. We're getting to the image, to the street view that has had the lower quality settings. See, it's all. Blurry and not really good quality, but and the earliest October 2007. Oh, I never noticed that. As you can see, they cut down some of the tree earlier that month. Must have been late October 2007. Next stop is home, my house. I'll show you guys what my house looks like right now. On camera. As you can see, this is September 2011. That's the old tracker that we got into that bad car accident on March 17th, St. Patrick's Day 2012 at like the intersection of Gammon Road by Walmart and Woodman's. I'll tell you guys the story about that another day, but, but yeah, and uh, and, um, there's, um, that's when our neighbors next door, Beth and Sim, lived there until June of 2018 when Johan and Bethany Vermach took over. There's our old lions that we had from 2009 to January 22nd, 2018 when Midnight scratched them and broke them April 12th, 2017. And, uh, we were not, we still have the blinds that are in Becca slash dad's room. I see the cabinet. That I had in my bedroom in Becca's room. We got those from Kurt and Cynthia. And then we had two of them. But Becca took one of them when she lived on Fresh Lane in 2014 and 2015. That tree got got diseased from that. If you remember that crazy polar vortex we had in January 2019. That tree got killed from that ice storm. That cold snap we had. But it wasn't until like November 4th, 2020, they took them, um, those guys were cutting down that tree, and, uh, 
I see that tree it was slightly smaller and and now there's dad's old Pontiac that broke in like March of 2013 and uh, mom was probably gone at the time maybe it was just look at that you can't see it our door used to be burgundy there and there's our old curtains that we had before that was August of 2007 and there's a you know who lived here before Beth and Sam Heather and uh, this girl named Ruby live next door there. And now where should I go next? I'll show you the. None. Springdale Street. See, this is the latest review in Mount Horb ever, so by far. July 2019. August 2007, August 2011, September 2013, July 2018, and July 2019. If you hear that beeping, that's our that's our washing machine going off. It's done with our load of laundry. Next up, my grandma Mary Carol's house. Which, honestly, it got new street view. This is from October 2021. This is Grandma Lucinda's old house that she passed away on August 31st, 2016. My Grandpa Kenny's, um, dad. Or mom. There's Grandpa's old Grand Marquis car that he got into a car accident on January 18th, 2020. Leading to his death, like, by graduation. The amount of dating along with look at it goes back just to September 2011 and then July 2019. See, look how different her window looked. I never noticed that. Look at July 2019. See, her window is completely different. Let's look at the other bedroom windows. I think they're the same. Hold on, my sister's calling me. What? What? Hold on, I'll pause the video, I'll be right back. Sorry my sister warned me because she was using a, I think her new phone, I think she got her something like that, and uh, what she warned me for is that she um wanted to know the password for our Wi-Fi, because we had April 9th for this year, we had to get new wife, new routers for our Spectrum. And anyways, as I was saying, the street view of September 2011 for Grandma Lucinda's old house. And uh, see, the house was for sale at at, at the time. Because I think Grandma Lucinda finally went to the nursing home at the time. And look at, there used to be like a little railing up there. Oh, oh, it was still there in September 2011. But of course, by the time Grandma and them even moved in, it was gone. And now I'll show you their old house. Their old little farmhouse they had. There's Grandpa's barn. There's Grandpa's barn. There's... Nothing changed from the barn. Let me show you the barn real quick. There it is. And, um, we go to September 2011. There's the dope barn door, see? And, uh, as you can see, there used to be, uh, let's go to over here. There used to be a house here that was Grandma's old house. But it got torn down in November 2015 because there was mold in the basement and Grandpa did not want to fix it up. So they moved over to the windows and then a year later they took it down. See? See, there's, there's the old house they used to live in. It was pretty bad. There, there it is in August 2007. There's the old the way that the uh, 
I remember the little air conditioning thing was, uh, said a white Westinghouse on it. And as you can see, they redid it and everything in 2016. It looks different now. Alright, I was thinking about going to that same 